They're back there. There were massive, two massive Daddy, helicopters. Godzilla. Black. They're military. Well, they were low. They were low. They were like right above us. Sheesh. Well, the airport is over that way. Oh, it's it's like right. Okay. It's over there. Okay, so there. I took my phone out. At, we had right close up, like within. 50 feet, 100 feet of the train by her dance studio, picked up from dance. And I was on photo in that video. So we're chasing the train in town, down through the other small neck, small town. The product of US Army is on the side of the vehicles. All these crazy type military vehicles I've never seen before. For some reason, the train has stopped over here with all the vehicles. That doesn't really make any sense. Okay, well this is like... This is a different... Oh, yeah, that's not the right train. That's not the same train. Military oh, wait, vehicles. it is. It's down there. It stopped. And they're all the. I can't really tell with the camera quality, but. Oh, look! Down here. Tons of military vehicles that way, too. Yup, all the. We vehicles. drove down to the next town from where I picked her up from dance, where we first saw it. I'm going to. Here. These military so this says, vehicles. No trespassing, Minnesota. So, we're right at the fence it says no trespassing minnesota law prohibits trespassing of bnsf railway property and they are stopped for so some odd reason and so there's all these vehicles and there's like heavy artillery vehicles like a bunch of them like probably a hundred so you guys know what so we're gonna go down this way we're gonna get to go back and look at the train that so the train is stopped. Look at all. There's like there's like tons of them. Like this you, train goes down far. It makes you wonder if they aren't offloading some of these vehicles in that private property railway area over there. See, like there's like look. those massive artillery vehicles. Like look at that. They had some kind of weird God, where are they? The tanks. Oh yeah, they had like weird tanks too, yeah. I can't drive anymore there was like these green navy green yep. cylindrical like propane things on the side that look like missiles and that oh yep and then they had down, like that's down there they had like black clamps like to like that had that were like two things two black things that were like iron made of iron to clamp around the circular thing and i'm like uh that seems wonder, like a missile I holder or something it was coming in from north dakota going over the river into minnesota yep yeah, I can turn around and we can get pictures of the end of the thing on the other side if it's moving again. Yeah, see. it's moving again back there. You can kind of see it. It's moving again. So they might be offloading stuff or switching. But, to, to, but like, that was like five minutes, though. I don't though. know. They could be switching tracks or something. Oh, there's only police cars here. <laughs> oh, yep. See, they're moving. Yep. Okay. Yeah, it's getting dark now. There you go. You have like these like oh look see like they have like these green military this green military one on the very end. And then they have all these like huge truck looking things. Look those black things, see they hold something. There. Oh they're stopping are they stopping again? Oh no, they're just going really slow. Yeah. Okay. Anyways. Anyways, that's okay. but we thought I, that was interesting. I did, to I did my citizen journalism. <laughs> Citizen journalism, let you know, major military vehicle movement from over the North Dakota border into the Minnesota border. <clears throat> okay, well, that concludes it. Okay, bye.